A very good morning team. This is Amir Mustafa. In this video, we will understand how we can check logs in AWS. Mostly, when we use AWS service, there might be chances that some application or a service may be down or crashes. That point of time, uh, checking logs will be very helpful. AWS provides us with CloudWatch. CloudWatch helps us with generating logs. So let us first see uh, in which cases uh, it provides elastic beanstalk ecs aws lambda cloud trail log agents route 53 and many more services so let us see uh, from the console itself how we can generate the logs we can uh, generate errors and see the logs also this is not specific to javascript uh, it can be done in any language. Let's see. So we go to a console, search CloudWatch. Okay. From here we go to log groups. So basically log group is a place where we see list of services over here and uh, all the all the possible services which can that can generate logs will be visible here. For example, uh, recently we were working on a serverless API lambda function. So we can see logs over here in real time also we will now generate error and uh, fix it so when we go to the serverless api we see list of logs all the latest log will be on the app like today i was just uh, before this video i did some uh, api hitting so this was create so let us let us now go to the application uh, 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 this is related to lambda if if you are uh, using ec2 instance you can go there and hit something so let's go to lambda now we'll be modifying some code and uh, see if log comes So this will be very easy. Just will modify some code. Uh, need not worry about this code. This can be any code. This can be in any language. For this case, we have used JavaScript. It could be Python. Uh, any language. So uh, now uh, error can be. We, we know that we can create. We, there can be many type of error. Like we forgot importing, or we did something error. For this case, what we'll do? We'll just go throw error this it can be any error for example right Suppose, suppose consider that we have forgotten this package and we write this not found ok we have created this error let us deploy this test this now if, if we go to our uh, suppose any instance like suppose where we are using we see that it is not working over there 
so for that uh, how we will see that uh, whether it is working or not working uh, see for the example if we come over here let's refresh this log string so we can see that our latest uh, latest log is here we can track by the time see latest one is over here now if we click this one we can search all the logs and we we noted that we got this message over here aws sdk not found uh, you think uh, here we have purposely uh, purposely added that error message but uh, in real scenario uh, we generated by mistake error by mistake so we see oh we have forgotten this package then we go over here and uh, yeah fix them so what we did we fix this we imported this package deployed this and this time we'll use our application it will work because we knew uh, we uh, we uh, we got the error message cause root cause of the error message from our log so this is very handy handy for development even for the